What's up guys? So we're here at the mall, Ingram Park Mall. I just wanted to go in and see what they had sitting. Um, and my car decided to beep. But anyway, um, yeah, I just wanted to go up in here and check out the shoes that are coming out tomorrow. If I can, take a little early look, show y'all them. If you entered some raffles or if you're going after the shoes, which are those Jordan 9, I forgot what they're calling them now. I think Flight Nostalgia is what they went with again with these. Um, but also just to see if they got anything dope in the stores uh, as far as the apparel. Because I've seen a couple of couple of things here and there. But uh, anyway, guys, enough rambling. Let's get up in there, see what they got. And uh, yeah, let's get into it. about coming in early and working nights is I'm here while everybody's at work basically uh, right now I passed by Shoe Palace but their music was jamming so basically I didn't record in there they did have some crimsons I'm not sure what sizes but let's step in here and see what we can check some out guys now we're checking these out this is a used size and uh yeah basically the same as the adults from what they told me um and it looks pretty dope pretty dope color blocking i like the way it has that just do it or what does it say dream it do it dream it do it with that jump man on there pretty dope i actually had to come back and do a voiceover because they had some music playing in the background that was real loud and i got a copyright strike so i had to redo everything uh, but yeah guys you can see the color blocking see the logo on the back and the colors pretty dope shoe overall but comment down below if y'all are going for it if y'all just gonna pass on it the leather looks pretty good quality as well um, it doesn't have that leather like the six the flint sixes and uh, the recent fours that are sitting right now but a uh, pretty dope shoe let's keep it moving to the Air Max Day collection this is my favorite shoe right here and it is a little bit loud uh, but I still like the shoe it actually feels pretty premium the bottom is a clear with the same coloring has that Nike have a Nike day smile guy and it has that aglet or whatever you call that that thing on the middle on the laces um, but overall it's a pretty dope shoe a little bit louder like I said on the colorway the interior does feel real soft um, and for 120 that's not too bad nowadays all the shoes are just raising their prices it seems like jordan brand wants 200 to be the next 190 but anyway let's get to these 95s y'all know i'm a fan of the 95s i actually don't like these as much as the air max ones but they do have the same touches as you can see there on the tongue and on these aglets or the lace where the lace the lace holders go it says have a nike day also so pretty dope the bottom is that clear milky uh purple but uh yeah they have a lot of dope stuff in this foot locker it's a foot locker at ingram park mall you can see they have these 305s right here for miami um i believe it's for miami and you can see it has the loud colors it's kind of vibrant i guess to represent the city of miami but um yeah i might be wrong about that i hope i'm not but i'm assuming 305 i've heard that before from miami but it's pretty dope overall now they do have a bunch of Air Maxes, which y'all know this is Air Max month. They have the Houston 95s still. They have a bunch of 95s right there. They have the 97s. So if y'all need anything, I mean, if you're locally around here, usually Foot Locker has the best selection. Sometimes Finish Line comes out with a couple things that other people don't get. Uh, but they do have a bunch of Air Maxes, like I said. 
and um yeah just overall a lot of stuff to look at they have these 720s on display right here i'm not the biggest fan of them they look a little bit too futuristic in my opinion comment down below what you think of these or if any of y'all went after and copped them especially for that 180 price point i've heard from some people it kind of feels like if a, a guy's version of a high heel since it has that bubble so high in the back as you can see it's higher in the back than it is in the front so it says it kind of pu pushes eh, pushes your foot to the front but uh yeah guys i'm moving on just trying to show you all the shoes that are in here y'all can see they have some filas they have the new pumas that just dropped uh, i think former simpson did a video on these today as well uh, they sent them to him but overall pretty dope but the foam was hard as hell i'm not gonna lie about that the foam was hard as hell on this pair uh they have some new balances right there some converses but yeah guys overall a lot of selection and i was actually surprised to see these in here i don't know if they're still sitting or if they sold out but they have these converse don c collabs they have it in this colorway which is pretty dope I, actually my my more leaning towards shoe if i were to have to cop one out of the two but uh i mean it's a little bit too high top for me but it does give you that 80s feel overall pretty dope shoe but let me know down below if y'all even went after those or y'all just slept on them easy pass they have this colorway as well which look which looks a little bit more vintage um but honestly i feel the black pair is just a little bit more easier to pull off for the daily wear but this pair is, looks pretty dope in person now these are the gel lights this is that collab that they did with um gi joe and i forgot the designer's name i didn't look anything up on these but they do have a lot of little custom touches like this logo on the back and both pairs have this bottom right here which is pretty dope y'all can see on the front it has like a scaly texture to it to represent the cobra i believe um not too much of a big fan of gi joe so i don't know everything about them guys but i'm trying to show you they do have a, a few dope collabs and different things in here so if y'all looking for some shoes man just roll up in there they got some stuff you can see they got that cobra on the back of this one and it has that same bottom as the other shoes now this is one of the most hated models the 312 but i seen this one on mike the compasses or sneaker life's uh vid and he pulled them off nice they look they look clean but um yeah they have these right here i'm not sure if they have any other sizes but this one's a size 13. all right man so we're chilling here now i had to get my little starbucks fix you know get some caffeine going but they had a few good things up in that foot locker right now uh y'all saw the jordan nines they look pretty dope in person actually the leather quality was pretty good um the nike air max day collection they have a lot of dope stuff but i just recently found out i hit on a sneakers and stuff raffle for those easy inertias so those will be coming in a, a video pretty soon once i do receive them um so look out for that and uh yeah i mean i don't know i don't want to just be talking this whole video so it is what it is but uh people just looking at me like i'm crazy but um yeah i appreciate damn d shouting me out in that video yesterday as well um I didn't even know about it until one of the subs commented on my video and let me know that he did that. But my video did go up, the subs, so I appreciate everybody that rocked with me and came from that channel and checked me out. Uh, but yeah, guys, I'm still kind of weird. I'm still getting used to this whole recording thing, even though it's been a while. It takes a little bit, I'm still looking around and people are looking at me kind of weird. Um, but anyway, we might get back to the house. I might record a little bit more. I might mix this up with another video, uh, but we'll just see how that goes. So uh, stay tuned. If this is the end of the video, hit that thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you're not subscribed already. And it's your boy Tony with 2 no Guy Kicks coming at you with yet again another video. Peace, guys, to the next one. Now, one more thing I want to throw in here, guys. I went ahead and put this video up so you could check them out a little bit further. But I completely forgot to mention this Thursday coming, I will be on a podcast uh, with a fellow YouTuber. And I'll be giving you all the link and information in the next video. And I'll keep keep throughout the my videos that come out before Thursday. I'll keep uh, letting y'all know what the deal is. I'll put it on my Instagram and my Twitter as well. Uh, but yeah, we're just going to be chopping it up, talking about shoes and, and this and that. Just different things uh, in the sneaker community and shoe uh, related topics. So if y'all want to check that out and check it out live, it's going to be Thursday at 7 p.m. on his channel. Like I said, I will be uh, linking his stuff down below for his channel so you could check it out. And you can subscribe to his channel if you like his content as well. 
But yeah, guys, I almost forgot to mention that. Just so you'll be aware, I will be on Thursday at 7 p.m. on his channel. But I'm going to get out of here. Sorry about the delay, guys. I just had to throw that in there real quick. It's your boy Tony with 210 Guy Kicks coming at you with yet again another video. Peace, guys, to the next one.